Hey friends, thanks for joining us here today. Today, Goblin Griff is going to be playing some We Party You the Balldozer. Goblin Griff, say hi to everybody today. Hi. He's going to be challenging Akira, Jesus, and Andre. Alright, Goblin Griff, get started whenever you're ready. <clears throat> While the game is loading, please definitely take a quick second to like and subscribe to Goblin Griff's channel. We hope that you find our tips and commentary useful and interesting. If you have any tips or comments, please comment below and let us know. Alright, let's see what that first minigame is, Griffin. And that first minigame is called Pogo Battle. Our tip for this game is to stay in the center of the stage don't jump after an opponent unless you're absolutely sure you're going to hit him or her. All right, Griffin, you got this. Do the best you can, honey. Hit number two to get started. Start. was pretty tough. They were ganging up on you, Griffin, but that's okay. It's still pretty early in this game of the Balldozer. You really want to get on top of it when it's starting round three and that bonus ring appears. Looks like Akira won and gets to drop four balls to start. start. Let's see how he does. Nice, nice. Three points is pretty good for a round one. Alright, Jesus, let's see how you do today. Take it. One's better than nothing. Start. Alright friends, let's go into round two. And the game is RC Drifters. Now this is one of Goblin Griff's favorite games. Our tip for this game is just to continuously put your thumb on number two and use that directional pad to drive around the track. You got this Griffin. got a new record 11 laps now does anybody out there play with RC or remote control cars Goblin Griff's thinking about doing a live action video with remote control cars if anybody knows a good brand or recommends one please comment below and let us know all right Griffin let's see how you do honey you get to drop four balls now make the most of them
we'll take that. Four more points. Now it's Andre. Start. That was pretty neat. Akira picked up two points without even doing anything. Alright, let's go into round three. The bonus ring has appeared. If you drop a ball in the bonus ring, you will cause an avalanche of balls to drop. That, that's how you really rack up the points. And the game is Snap Judgment. Our tip for this game is to hover around the number one. Flash those car signs that do not appear in the middle. You got this, Griffin. Start. Perfect. Good job, Griffin. Way to concentrate. Way to concentrate. Now, let's see if you could take advantage of the four balls and cause an avalanche. All right, Griffin. This is a good chance to pick up a lot of points. Let's see what you could do, honey. All right, you got this. Take your time. Unfortunately, the top rack does not look too filled. Ooh, at the last minute, you did drop a ball in to the ring. Let's see if you can take advantage of it with these bonus balls. Here they come. Well, that wasn't too big of a push. Hopefully there will be one more push. We can't complain, 18's a good score so far. But that gold ball on the right is definitely in play. Let's see if one of your opponents could pick it up. And finally, Andre. All it takes is one ball to trigger the avalanche. Let's see how he does. All right, friends, let's go into round four. And the mini game is called Shutterbird. In this game, what you really need to do is move around quickly and rapidly, zooming in and out and finding the bird with the heavy eyebrows. Sometimes it just 
pays off to go in the right direction. Let's see how you do, Griffin. The bird is yellow. Start. You nailed it. We'll take it. We'll take it. Good job, Griffin. You have a chance now to get those golden balls on the far right. Finish. I don't know if it'll pay off to drop the balls in that area or try to go for an avalanche. Let's study the board, Griffin, and see what we think you should do. Okay, look at the top rack. Let's see if those balls are really... Yeah, see, it's not too, not too active. Well, you dropped the green one. That should pay off, I think. Should get enough of an avalanche to get an, at least one of those gold balls on the far right. Let's go for a good push, guys. It paid off. I don't know if you're going to get another push, but maybe. Let's see. Not quite. 40 points is pretty good though, Griffin. You got a good sized lead against Jesus. He could trigger an avalanche and get that golden ball on the right and quickly catch up. Oh, he just missed triggering, triggering the avalanche. That's a tough brace. All right, Andre, you same thing. Go for that avalanche or go for the golden ball. Let's see how you do, honey. Not honey. He's not my honey. Griffin is. Sorry. Well, he got the golden ball, but he also got the skull ball. Best he could do is get that golden ball on the left as well. He was close, he's got it. Oh. <clears throat> That's a good score though. A lot of points were picked up. Jesus, I think, or is it Akira? Yep, it's Akira. Start. All right, this is the final round. Griffin has a pretty good sized lead, 40 points. The next player has 20 points, so Griffin, you're in good shape. Good playing so far today, okay? Let's see what the mini game is. There are two bonus rings, one golden ball in play. Oh, it's one of Griffin's favorites. It's called Space Zappers. Our tip for this game is try to anticipate where the UFO ship will show up and zap it. Also, when you see that alien ship with three aliens, go for that ship because that ship is worth three points. Griffin, you ready? All right, honey, you got this. Take your time. Start. Did it, Griffin? All right, Griffin. You just get a drop. You just need to drop three more balls. We'll try to tell you when to hit drop. 
Let's go ahead and turn on the the camera. All right, Griffin, you got this, okay? Drop the ball when you think you're ready. Try to get it. Okay, Griffin, not too hurt, not too. Don't be in too much of a hurry, okay, honey? That's okay. Hopefully your lead will hold up. That's all right, Griffin. You're a little bit in shock. Let's just keep the webcam on the rest of the way. See if any... It's mainly Andre. If Andre picks up 20 points, he can catch you and, and win. Oh, the avalanche. Look at that, Jesus. All right, Griffin. Nice. Just be patient. Let's see how everybody does. All right, Andre. Let's see if you could get 20 points. You guys think Andre could get 20 points? I don't know. Ooh, he had some remnant balls dropped. No, yeah, no. Now it's up to Akira. Akira needs to get, wow, that's quite a bit, 33 points. Otherwise, Goblin Griff is the winner. One ball is all you need, Griffin, to trigger the avalanche. Here they come. Oh, that was epically close. Alright, everybody, here comes the winner. And Griffin won. Alright, Griffin, say bye to everybody. We'd like to thank you for watching our video here today. Please. Goblin Griff is the winner. Everybody, please have a great day, and we'll see you next time.